C I E T N C E R T presents audiobook of mathematics for class 2 entitled Math Magic 2. This is the chapter 15 How Many Pony Tales from page 124 to 128. Page 124. Let's start reading chapter 15. This page is divided into two parts. Each part has questions based on pictures. Let's begin reading this page. Part 1. Letters in Names The picture shows three boys and one girl, each holding a flashcard of their name in their hands. Boy 1. Ramesh Boy 2. Aftab Girl 1. Maria Boy 3. Santosh Below this picture is written, Ask your friends to write their names on a paper. Find out. Question. A. The number of names ending with the same letter. Question. B. One letter with which no name starts. Question. C. The number of names starting with the same letter. Part 2. Fruit Seller Picture 2 on the right side shows a fruit seller holding a basket full of fruits like bananas, apples, oranges and mangoes on his head. He is calling people by saying, Bananas, apples, oranges, Fresh fruits for you. On the left side, the text reads as The fruit seller has many fruits for you. Look at them and find out what the different fruits are. Page 125. This page is divided into two parts. Each part has questions based on pictures. In part 1, the fruit seller from previous page continues. Let's begin reading this page. Part 1. Count and Write On left-hand side there is a table of two columns and three rows. Column 1 presents the pictures of fruits from the fruit seller's basket and column 2 provides space for writing the number of fruits. The table reads as Row 1. Column 1 has picture of 4 apples. Column 2 has empty space for writing number of fruits. Row 2. Column 1 has picture of 5 bananas. Column 2 has empty space for writing number of fruits. Row 3. Column 1 has picture of 3 oranges. Column 2 has empty space for writing number of fruits. On the right side there is a picture of a parrot who is saying, I like guavas. What do you like? Part 2. Hairstyles. In this part, the text is on the left side and picture is on the right side. Mala is going to school. Picture shows a girl Carrying a school, carrying school bag, going to school. Her mother has combed her hair. The picture on the right side shows Mala sitting in front of her mother who is combing her hair. Mala has two ponytails. The picture shows face of Mala with two ponytails. Look at the children in your class. All children comb their hair in different ways. The picture on the right side shows faces of five children, two girls and three boys, each having different hairstyle. Question. Look and write down. There is a table with two columns and three rows for this question. In column one, picture of children with different hairstyles is given. And in column two, Empty spaces are provided for writing answers. Row 1. 
Column 1 has a picture of a girl with only one ponytail. Column 2 has a blank space for the answer. Row 2. Column 1 has a picture of a girl with two ponytails. Column 2 has an empty space for writing your answer. Row 3. Column 1 has a picture of a boy with short hair. Column 2 has an empty space for your answer. Page 126. This page is divided into two parts. The story of ponytails continues in part 1 and in part 2, new story titled Shoe Numbers begins. Let's start reading this page. Part 1. Find out and fill in the blanks. Question A. The number of children with one ponytail is dash then the number of children with two ponytails. The options are more or less. Question B. Dash. Children have no ponytail. Part 2. Shoe numbers. Look at the feet of children in your class. Everybody is wearing shoes, chappals or sandals. Look at the sole of the shoes or chappals. If there is a number on the sole, it is your shoe size. Fill this table. Table has two columns. Column 1 is for shoe size and column 2 is for number of children. Row 1. Column 1 has shoe size number 9. Column 2 has empty space for writing the number of children having shoe size 9. Row 2. Column 1 has shoe size number 10. Column 2 has empty space for writing the number of children having shoe size 10. Row 3. Column 1 has shoe size number 11. Column 2 has empty space for writing the number of children having shoe size 11. Page 127 This page is divided into two parts. The story of shoe number continues in part 1 and in part 2, new story titled Water We Drink begins. Let's start reading this page. Part 1. Find out. Question. A. How many have nine size shoes? Dash children. Question B. The number of children with eleven size shoes is? Dash. Question C. The largest number of children have dash size shoes. Question D. The smallest number of children have dash size shoes. Part 2. Water we drink. Picture 1 on the right side of the title shows two glasses of water on the table and a boy standing next to table is drinking water from a glass held in his hands. Activity. We drink water every day. Ask your friends how many glasses of water they drink in a day and write below. There is a table with two columns and five rows. Column 1 is for how many glasses and column 2 is for number of children. Row 1, column 1 has a picture of a glass of water and column 2 has space for writing number of children who drink one glass of water in a day. Row 2. Column 1 has a picture of two glasses of water and column 2 has space for writing number of children who drink two glasses of water in a day. Row 3. Column 1 has a picture of three glasses of water and column 2 has space for writing number of children who drink three glasses of water in a day. Row 4. Column 1 has a picture of four glasses of water and column 2 has space for writing number of children who drink four glasses of water in a day. Row 5. 
column 1 has a picture of 5 glasses of water and column 2 has space for writing number of children who drink 5 glasses of water in a day. Find out. Question A. The number of children who drink 1 glass of water is dash B. 5 glasses of water is drunk by dash children. Question C. The number of children who drink 3 glasses of water is dash than children who drink 2 glasses of water. The options are more or less. Page 128. The color you like. There are many colors around you. Picture 1 on the right side shows five children wearing different colored clothes, forming a circle by holding hands. Ask your friends about the color they like most. How many children like yellow? Write the number in the table. Fill the table for other colors. The table has two columns and four rows. Column 1 has picture of colors and is for color liked. And column 2 is for number of children. Row 1. Column 1 has picture of yellow square box. And column 2 has space for writing the number of children liking yellow color. Row 2. Column 1 has picture of red square box and column 2 has space for writing the number of children liking red color. Row 3. Column 1 has picture of blue square box and column 2 has space for writing the number of children liking blue color. Row 4. Column 1 has picture of green square box and column 2 has space for writing the number of children liking green color. Question. Find out and color the box. Part A. Most children like dash color. Part B. Children who like dash color are more than children who like dash color. Part C. Children who like dash color are less than children who like dash color. Footnote. Encourage children to interact with one another in small groups and collect information as required. Let them fill information in the tables and attempt to answer the find out questions. The chapter 15 of total 15 chapters of the book ends here.